This is the 224th anniversary of the American Constitution, one of the greatest documents ever written, a document that protected all rights, including the economic rights that are critical to entrepreneurial business successes. The document was intended to address the two great conflicts of all societies. Madison and others realized that government was necessary because men were not angels, but that government, as Washington warned, was a, like fire, a dangerous servant and a powerful master. The Constitution was created to reconcile these two elements of society by building a firewall, a series of protective devices which restricted government to its proper sphere. Those firewalls included elements such as a separation of power, which limited and enumerated the powers of the federal government, gave most powers to states and most of all to the peoples of the United States. That document was one of the most creative ways of liberating the human spirit, the entrepreneurial spirit, which created the economic growth that America experienced. Its great day was probably in 1905 in a decision by the Supreme Court called Lochner, which, is, which struck down a state attempt to restrict business rights to decide how many hours their workers could do. It was a baker situation. But in the late 19th century, a group fearful or dubious about the wisdom of restraining government. Why should Leviathan be restrained? Because these believe that that would restrict the ability of government to do good things. The majority should always have the right to do anything it wished to do so. That idea was joined by economic interests who saw in the weakening of the Constitution an ability to ritzy, to make short-term gains. That movement weakened the Constitution to the point where in 1942, in a, in a landmark decision, Wickard versus Filburn, the, court, the Supreme Court of the United States decided that a wheat farmer growing his own wheat on his own farm for his own use could still be regulated by the federal government. And that weakening continued throughout the, the period since. Till today, we have government intervening in almost every decision business makes, where every economic decision in America is potentially controlled in various ways by the federal government. That, that activity has led to the regulatory leviathan we labor under today. What can be done about this? What can be done to restore the restraints on government, bring government back to its proper sphere, and allow the entrepreneurial business community to, to solve most of the world's, America's problems? CI's role in that is to look at those fire bricks that are still relatively intact, the parts of the Constitution that still restrain Leviathan, and by litigating to strengthen those bricks, create the moral understanding that makes it possible to replace some of the bricks that have fallen away, to replace some of the chinks that have been opened in the firewall restricting government. We do so in a number of areas. We've had a rent control case in New York on the takings clause. We work to restore the rights of commercial free speech to ensure the First Amendment protects those, not just political speech. We believe the business community has a critical need to ally with CEI and other groups who are playing that role. That is, after all, the way the attacks on the Constitution occurred, by alliances between economic groups seeing the weakening of the Constitution as benefiting them and intellectual groups who thought it was the right thing to do. And the American people today are recovering and restoring their understanding and, and support for the Constitution. The time is right to move ahead and create that. It is important that we do so. Because without a restoration of the protections of the Constitution for economic liberty, how can business survive in the future in America? The Constitution, like all human documents, is not perfect. But it has protected our liberties, economic and civil, for many, many years and it is vastly better than what we have now. It is time we work together to restore it.